So now let's add uh, the navigation in our application. So we'll be adding this in this app screen. Now let's create a couple of more screens, right? So in this home screen, let's click on this plus icon and we'll create, let's say, explore.js, explore screen, right? And now go to this app.js, copy these two lines, control C, control V, and here yeah, let's create a one functional component, explore const explore, explore. Uh, this will be equal to arrow function and we'll export it expor to export defa default expore right like so right and here we will return ret urn return a view and for now let's uh, write here simple text right yeah like so and let's here write explore SCRWN like so and we will be giving this a uh, style with flex of one right okay so I will copy this thing control C I will save this file right inside here I will create one more file right here let's give this a name of S U S C R I B E subscribe dot js dot j s and I will paste everything in here right here instead of explore i will press control d control d and i will replace this explore with s u s c r i b subscribe s u s c r i b like so for now i think uh, let's make this three screen right and we need one more screen that is of video player screen right so i just click again this on plus icon here v i t e o video p l a y e r dot j s right and here paste this again and instead of this explore we will press ctrl d and here we will be writing video pla yr and here we will be writing uh, video pla yr right let's go to this again on subscribe screen and let's change this text to uh, s s u b subs videos right let's save this right so we have now enough of the screens right okay so we'll, let's add navigation now so we need to pull out couple of things right we need to pull out couple of components so we need to import something from at the rate uh, react uh, navigation stack and that's oh not the stack react navigation at the rate native right native and that something is called a uh, native container right uh, navigation container right okay we need to pull out a uh, stack and drawer as well right so let's import import something from uh, at the rate react navigation stack and that something is called create stack navigator create stack navigator like so right i will duplicate this line right instead of this stack i would now i will write slash uh, bottom tabs right and this is called as i think tab create tab yeah create bottom tab navigator like so so i think this is it uh, this is all we need for now right okay so now let's make use uh, of so i will be getting rid of this all thing which i have uh, i have given this margin top right of status bar height oh so I think I should copy this command control C I should paste uh, this inside all the components uh, inside this header right I would paste this control V right I am importing constant right from here I will go to my search screen right uh, I would paste this in here also right and I should uh, where is our header I should do this control C I would paste this inside this as well right okay save this uh, yeah save this and I need to paste this inside this uh, whole video player as well right so this is also a separate stack right so we have three stacks yeah so I just control V and go to header control C and control V like so okay it's done now let's again uh, go to this app.js right so i will be getting rid of all the things things we have in here instead i will be writing here na 
a navigation container they are this one right and inside this first we need to uh, create stack right so here i am writing const uh, stack 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 and we'll be invoking create stack c r e create st uh, create stack navigator and like so and i will press alt shift down key here i will be writing uh, tabs and here i will be writing create bottom tab navigator like so now here we need to write this sta stack dot na uh, dot navigator and i will close this right inside this I, i need to put some of the stacks right so here i don't need a header which is coming uh, by default with the stack navigator so i will be writing here header h e a header mode and i will be writing here none because i don't want header we have made our custom header right and then we need some screens st sta stack dot screens like so let's self close this now let's give this a name so one will be root uh, let's give it a name of root home right this will be a root home first screen which will have different tabs right and this will show the component of let's say we don't we haven't created that component right now Let, let's keep this empty right then we'll be having a uh, one search screen s e a r c h search screen and it will show it will show this search screen com component so here i will be passing just s e a r c h like so and then i will duplicate this and again uh, i will be showing video player so i need to import video pla player pl player from dot Uh, slash src and inside src we have this screens inside this screens we have this video player like uh, this one like so okay so let's here write video v i d e o uh, this video player right so now we have this wired up our search screen and video screen now here we need to put uh, the tab navigator right here we need to combine stack and tab navigator right uh, let's create now a separate component for that right so here we will be creating const uh, home root home let's give it a name of let's say root home right okay inside this we will be having the different tab navigation sites So here I will be returning tab dot navigator right, and inside this we'll be having three uh, two screens uh, for now, or maybe three screen. Let's see tab dot screen, and I will self close it, and let's give it a name of first screen will be our home screen. right so here let's give it a name of home and it will show the component c o m p o component of this home right h o h o m e home at right? this component right now let's duplicate that alt shift down key again next screen will be of let's say explore screen right e x p l o r e explore and it will show explore components so we need to import that import e x p l o explore from uh dot slash src and the screens and then we have this explore i will alt shift down key again we need to pull out let's say subscribe right yeah so let's pull that out s u s c r i b subscribe and again instead of explore here i need to write uh the subscribe and here uh we need to here write explore e x uh this one explore and i will duplicate that and here write s u s c r i b e subscribe and this will show the subscribe component s u uh this one 
like so so now we need to pass this root uh, home control c to this right control v like so so this is how we can combine this tab navigators uh, and stack navigator so i am putting all these tabs inside this stack screen right i am putting all these tab navigator inside this uh, screen okay inside this stack screen okay so this is how we are going to structure so we'll be testing this app in the next video i think this is enough for the video so i'll see you guys in the next video